a mystery weather person for you tonight on the 6 o'clock news. Sean, you're no mystery, are you? Mystery is over, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> you couldn't pick a better day to do weather, though. It was just about a perfect really? day outside. I don't think we could have added anything to make it any better. The high today, 76 degrees. The low, a very chilly 43, as you can see that high, about 6 degrees above normal. The record, 89 degrees back in 1963. The record low, 26 degrees back in 1964. And we remain a little light in the rain bucket, 2200 for the month. Right now outside, we continue with mostly clear skies. The temperature remains at that high of 76 degrees. Winds are out of the southeast at 9 miles an hour. The humidity, 31 percent, and the pressure is falling. Across Illinois right now, temperatures are pretty much in the mid-70s, 75 degrees in Decatur. There's that 76 in Springfield and 75 degrees in Quincy at this hour. If you have any outdoor plans tonight, a lot of football games in the area, these temperatures should settle back into the mid-60s or so into the next couple of hours. A lot of clear skies throughout the area, all of Illinois right now, pretty clear. And as you can see, as you head to the further to the northwest, there are some partly cloudy conditions. These clouds will have a tendency to ride off to the north overnight tonight. Most of the clouds further south. This is that system that brought us the rain showers yesterday. These all continue to move away from us. Partly cloudy skies as you extend further west. This is what's going to move in here and give us a pretty nice start to the weekend. Where there are no clouds, there is no rain. Illinois dry at this hour. A lot of rain showers off to our south. Again, these continue to move away from us. Two things I want to point out that are going to affect our weather as we work through the weekend. First, all this rain sh rainfall in Texas right now. This is the remnants of Hurricane Pauline. This moisture will continue riding to the northeast as we work into the second half of the weekend and into the first part of next week. Also, further west, a lot of rain showers developing out that way. This is ahead of a cold front that's going to slowly move our way and have a big impact on our weather as we get into the first part of next week. It's high pressure that's setting the scene today. That's what gave us the clear skies and warm temperatures. It's also going to give us a good start to the weekend tomorrow, but this will move off to the east, and the weather maker for the second half of the weekend is that cold front. It's going to bring us some precipitation on Sunday and much cooler temperatures as we get into next week. Low temperatures tonight, mostly 40s and 50s. I think with the clear skies, this area of 40s will sag further south. I think we'll end up in the mid-40s here in central Illinois. We'll rebound nicely tomorrow. Should have high temperatures in the 70s. As that cold front continues to move closer from the west, that'll give us a chance of rain as we get into Sunday. Here's your forecast then for the rest of tonight. Clear skies, cooling off a low of about 44 degrees. Winds out of the southeast. Tomorrow we'll start out sunny, clouds building through the afternoon, a high of about 75 degrees, winds out of the southeast. Tomorrow night, cloudy, a slight chance of showers developing, a low of 60, and looking into the week, our first Sunday, cloudy, rain likely, could be pretty significant, a high of 72, and more rain on Monday, clearing out by Tuesday. Look at those high temperatures, 55, as we get toward the middle of the week. It's going to feel a lot more fall-like. You did that week. just like